Hello and welcome to Daily Records. I am Tommy Burton and today's Daily Record is the debut album by Leon Redbone, released on Warner Brothers Records in 1975. This is On the Track. Um, and Leon Redbone is an interesting artist. Now this album cover um, was done by an uh, animation artist that a lot of people are familiar with from Warner Brothers cartoons as if you didn't know it was Warner Brothers. Uh, this is uh, Michigan J. Frog uh, and uh, Chuck Jones did the artwork uh, and a lot of you uh, will know about that. Leon Redbone is an interesting artist. Now I would classify this as a ragtime album uh, if anything and for those of you who are familiar with, uh, with Leon, um, I mean this album in particular, he did all the arrangements and everything uh, for the album. Um, put together a, a good sort of um, ragtime band here. Uh, clarinet, trombone, trumpet, uh, also uh, a little violin and fiddle, um, things like that. Uh, while uh, Leon just kind of strums a guitar with a very interesting um, sort of voice, very throwback. Um, and not uh, very common, particularly um, for pop music, but it's not really pop music. And Leon never really was kind of a pop guy. Now, a lot of these songs you probably know, uh, Ain't Misbehavin', um, Some of These Days, the Shelton Brooks song, uh, Polly, Wally, Polly Wally Doodle, um, Lonnie, Donig Lonnie Johnson, sorry, Lonnie Donegan, a skiffle artist, Lonnie Johnson's Haunted House, um, you know, songs that, that are just kind of laid back uh, and easy to, easy to follow. Um, Leon uh, has been around for quite a while. Um, he's, he's, uh, you've heard his voice uh, because he's, he's been a voice actor and, and has appeared in commercials and things. Um, and, and, you know, his voice specializes sort of jazz, uh, blues, and sort of the old Tin Pan Alley uh, type stuff. Uh, he usually wears a, a, a Panama hat. Uh, usually dark sunglasses and a, and a black tie. Uh, and so just, uh, he's been around for, for, for quite a while. Um, now he has retired recently, so he, he doesn't uh, perform and play anymore. But, um, one of the ways you would know Leon Redbone, uh, some of my eighties people that are close to my age, he did the theme, uh, to the television series, Mr. Belvedere. Uh, and he's put out about 16 records, but this was his, his first one. Uh, and like I said, he, um, kind of a mysterious background, uh, a name like Leon Redbone obviously wasn't, uh, a, a birth name. Uh, but, um, what little is known, uh, uh, he, um, I believe he's uh, Canadian, uh, is his nationality. Uh, and he, he did, um, change his name to Leon Redbone. And so he's kind of been a little bit of a mystery artist. He also appeared uh, in early uh, Saturday Night Live. Um, and so he, he's on there. So he's been around. What do you think? What do you know about Leon Redbone? Um, what are your thoughts about it? Uh, comment, like, share, subscribe, all of that stuff. I love interacting with you guys. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. It's Tommy Burton 75 In the meantime, I'll see you all again tomorrow with another daily record.